Hi everyone, uh, Alien uh, releases a new mod for his Exa gear and he has new four options to install Exa gear and uh, this one is for Tonep only. This one integrates virtual overlay in the app itself. This is also by another one but with another interface. And if you still want to use the classic uh, separate VLGL overlay app, you can use this app. I installed the one with from the mod by uh, XH. I installed the mod by this and use this VLGL OBB file. And this looks this way. Oops, it crashed. And now you can see here, it's like the old all mod one, you can scroll down the field and check those boxes to set your virtual options. If you uh, already saw the multi-wine edition, it is like this, the option looks the same. And in this version, you can add wine 4 and 6. I add wine 6 at first. So let's get started. So what's new in this edition, um, if you are an Android 12 user, uh, you always had the problem to uh, use the keyboard and uh, if you now it's fixed you can always use the keyboard to write or edit something in a text file without to change the control or double tip fix workaround to um, to access the keyboard so what's new as i said virtual overlay is now added you can choose to free mesa editions otherwise it's almost the same some fix are added but um, if you already know the advantages of this of this cache you might be familiar with this so so if you have a game that doesn't work with uh, turnip mode for example the forest It will crash before you get to the plane scene. Let's get loaded up. So, it's almost finished. Oops, it's crashed. So let's change the wine D3D to two. Let's load it up again. Okay, I just skipped the loading time, so you can run it now. Let's see. Okay, it's booted, but it will crash at the loading scene. There you go. And it sometimes helps to switch to VirtualL to see if the game works. So let's change it again. Let's change to Misa this version. No, 
freezes. Let's reboot. So it's invisible. Oh, don't forget to change what uh, to deactivate the hub mode. Virtual mode doesn't support it. So change it to zero if you have. Okay. Okay, it's installed. So let's check at the forest again. Again, long loading time. I will skip again. So let's boot it up. It might not work because it's on DirectX 10 or 11, uh, 11 version, but uh, it only works with DirectX 9, so it might crash anyway. So let's try after this another game. Yeah, as expected, it's not working. Direct X, wrong version. Let's try another game. Okay, now I'm back with uh, in other installed games. Let's try Virtual Overlay again. Let's try Mesa this one. Set 720. And uh, Open Channel 3.3. And that should be it. Okay. So, oh. Okay, let's try it first an easy game. Hydro Truck Simulator 2 Okay, it's booting
we kind of expect some graphical glitches because virtual mode has sometimes some weird colors in some games and we have to try other Mesa versions so I tried it before and uh, with Mesa 21 it's the best for this game still not all correct colors but not all white or wrong colors at all okay here we go okay let's go Sound now going in. Okay, well, it runs pretty okay with virtual. Okay. Oh, I got stuck. Help. Okay, I failed, so never mind. See, it's working, and now we can just switch, like all other caches, of course, back to Talib. Choose which one, then open share version, my D3D we can let it be, check this game again, and here we go. So here we go, and you can see the colors are all correct now, and the game is more smooth. Check it here. All right. So Snapdragon H and One can run with virtual, also Mali users, and all those other Snapdragon. Devices can use turnip mode with Android 12 keyboard fix. So let's stop here. Okay. That's it.